Hello and welcome back to Wireman's Whimsy. We are continuing with our series on the You Are Beautiful stamp set. Um, it's a super simple stamp set, just a couple of um, floral stamps and then some really pretty greetings. So I'm going to endeavor to use the stamps in lots of different ways this week. So what I've done is on this one, it's Melon Mambo with Granny Apple Green leaves. And I tried different ways to color the berries differently. And this is the most effective way I came up with. And you literally stamp them all in the green and take your blends and just color the berries over. Um, so the one we're going to do on the video today is in uh, Blueberry Bushel. So I've got my card base. I've got a five and a quarter by four piece of basic white. And I'm just going to uh, stamp all the way around the edge and then into the interior. It's almost like a one sheet wonder. And you can make it as busy or as plain as you like. And this one is a bit more open. I'm making this one a little bit more busy. It means I've got more coloring to do with my uh, blends but that is okay. This would be really pretty as a Christmas card as well. Um, if you've got a nice Christmas greeting that you like to use, you could do this in uh, Mossy Meadow and um, Cherry Cobbler and uh, carry on like that. Uh, so uh, it is, it's got a little bit of uh, versatility to it. So what we're going to do now is we're going to take our blends and I think it's going to be this way up because I've left this side a little bit emptier than the other side. And so that's where we're going to put our greeting. And I'm just dabbing some color on. The blends are very juicy, so you don't want to do too much because it'll just bleed out the sides of your berries here. So just coming in and filling those berries in. And there we go. So last week we got a couple of new subscribers, new people commenting on the channel, and I love hearing your comments. Um, and even if it's just a love this or just a single word, if I say, do you prefer the pink or the blue and you say pink or blue, I love getting those comments back and I do answer each and every one of them. But I do have a question for everybody who's watching. I struggle with when to post. When are you going to see the videos um, and when do you watch? And now I'm in Mountain Standard Time in Alberta. Um, so if you watch at seven o'clock, but you're on the West Coast or the East Coast, just tell me what time zone you're in and what time you watch. And then um, I can kind of cater the videos to post when you're uh, most likely to watch. I don't know if it's after supper or if it's mid afternoon or on a Sunday, do you watch first thing in the morning or is it a, something you do in the afternoon? So just, you know, checking in to see when uh, you all watch YouTube. So, or do you just get the notification that the video is posted and then you watch it then? So lots of different options. And if it changes day to day, it changes day to day. So I've already stamped the greeting and I've used the Stylish Shapes banner dies to cut it down. Um, and just to add some interest, instead of just plunking it down, I just trimmed the edge off. I just wanna make sure that I'm still in a frame and I am. I just trimmed it down. There we go. If you find that your blade ever gets stuck like mine just did, don't pull on it because it'll tear your paper. Just lift up, put the blade down kind of in the middle of what you want to uh, cut and then move your blade back and forth. And that way you don't end up tearing or snagging an edge. So we're just going to put that down like that. And then I've taken some of the iridescent foil gems and I've colored them with the uh, Azure Afternoon because I don't have blueberry bushel. So I've colored them with the Azure Afternoon. So they're a little bit lighter, but it still adds just that little bit of color and lifts the card a little bit. I'm just gonna pop one down here as well. Kind of draws the eye around the greeting a little bit, but that is both versions of the card. 
And on the blueberry bushel one, it's harder to see the coloring, um, whereas on the melon mamba one, it's easier, but you can tell that there's a difference and you can see it. So thank you so much for watching and let me know when you watch.